new storm team. Welcome back to KX News at 6. Let's go ahead and show our current storm team radar this evening. Seeing some increasing clouds out towards west. A couple of light showers out towards the beach area right now. Some more showers possible out in Montana. Maybe seeing more and more of these as we progress further along to about 10, 11 o'clock or so, and perhaps into our central areas as we get beyond the midnight hour. Temperatures right now holding in those 90s, still in a lot of our central locations, seeing a 97 for the capital city, some 80s back towards the eastern tier. Still 101 right now in Flasher and 107 degrees out towards Hedinger. So not quite as hot as a few hours ago. Did see some 109s earlier today, but beginning to cool off a bit as you progress further along into the evening. Here were some of those highs we saw today. Hedinger breaking their previous record of 99 degrees, getting to 108 today. Same for Beach getting to 108, breaking their previous record of 106 degrees set just about six years ago or so. Williston just got there about five o'clock or so, so a few hours ago, 107 degrees for that daytime high today, breaking their previous record of 105 from back in 1930. Looking at our overall dew points right now, holding in those 70s for a lot of our far northern areas, seeing a 78 right now in Mo Mohall, so it is downright sticky and muggy up towards the far north. Not seeing much in the way of a dew point, though, down towards that southwest, just seeing some 30s and 40s, so a bit of a fire risk down towards that southwestern corner here for us for the remainder of the evening hours. If we go ahead and look at tomorrow's daytime highs, not quite as hot as today, so that is sort of some good news for a lot of us, seeing some 70s for those highs up towards the far north, and of course, those mid 80s out towards the west. A bit warmer though down towards the southeast, getting close to 90 down towards Medina. Perhaps Ashley gets there as well. So a bit warmer back towards the east here for us tomorrow. Looking ahead to our Saturday, a bit warmer than tomorrow. In fact, most of us getting close to 90 out towards the west, even some 97s down towards the Hedinger area. So we could get close to the triple digits once again here for us on Saturday afternoon, but a bit of a bump up compared to tomorrow. Look at our precision cast right now. We'll continue to see some of those showers and storms out towards the west over the next few hours or so, possibly filtering into our central areas as you get into very early on Friday morning. As you look ahead to tomorrow afternoon, some more showers certainly possible again in our central areas back towards the northeastern corner. We'll be seeing more and more of these as we progress through tomorrow into the rest of the weekend. Nothing really severe at this point. May get some hail in some of those cells, but overall we should be in pretty good shape as far as that severe signal is concerned the next few days. But some more rains likely on the way, as I said, as we get through the next several days overall. If you go ahead and look at Williston's five day forecast again tomorrow, about 20 degrees cooler than we saw today for that daytime high, sitting at 87 degrees again. May see some showers early in the morning and possibly in the afternoon as well. Looking ahead to our Saturday, 91 degrees. And of course, look at next week, 93 on Monday, 90, 98 again on Tuesday. So getting hotter and hotter once again as you get into mid next week. Dickinson's five day forecast, 84 tomorrow. So some relief here, at least for one day at least and 92 degrees there for us on Saturday getting hotter and hotter once again as you progress to the first half of next week. Checking out my not seven day forecast tomorrow 82 degrees and then back to 90 for Saturday. Same thing for Monday as well and Tuesday probably the hottest day for next week seeing a 95 for the Magic City but not quite as hot as this week so that's certainly some good news and Bismarck seven day forecast 86 tomorrow some showers possible mainly during the afternoon and evening hours and again some possible showers and storms over the next several days overall, but sitting near 90 here for us for the next seven days, and it is late it is late July and early August, so getting hotter and hotter as we progress at the next couple of weeks. Yeah, it was a little mild start in June, but now we're really feeling it, aren't we? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was a little bit of a cool spring, so we're kind of making up for it right now as we get into the peak summer. And hey, you know, like you said earlier, we'll be back into the cold spell as we get to October. So you might as well just enjoy those hundreds while they're there. Yeah. If I'm we didn't, what would we complain about? I know, right? Yeah. We wouldn't have anything to complain. We don't want to get shortchanged on yeah. summer and be like, where was summer? We exactly. didn't get any hot days. Yes, we're, we're here for it for now anyway. Kenny, thank you so much. Coming up next. In